Okay, this is a video on how to install maps and airspaces onto your Kobo XC saw. Okay, let's turn it on here. Wait for the light. Okay, once it's turned on, if we're going to connect it to the computer, you want to click down here onto nickel. and just wait for it to load up okay once it's done that then going to plug it into the computer going to ask do you want to connect to a computer yes connect okay so it's connected now you will see it's come up on the computer uh, you can open the folder a few files uh, and it's already installed with all the software so if you want to add maps or airspaces go to XC saw data this is where we're going to add our files so go on to xcsaw.org got maps and waypoints here download maps and then click the area you want to install so let's go for Corsica standard or high res they're not really that much of a different size and there's not that much difference in the picture so I just go for standard save file remember what it's called so you can find it later FRA course that's downloaded and now let's do the same for the air map so we're going back down to airspaces download airspaces from Sorum web Europe and lo and behold Corsica isn't there brilliant okay let's try France as it's part of France and see if it comes up so go on to open air format right click save link as and then just download it again remember the name I'm saying it already exists because I've downloaded it before but yes okay so we've now downloaded Corsica and airspaces for France. Okay, to upload them to the Kobo, we bring up our downloads folder, and you'll see they're both at the top airspace France and Corsica file there. Okay, we'll highlight both of them and copy. And just paste them into that XC saw data file which is on the Kobo. So open that, put them into there, paste them in. So I've just done one. Okay, didn't do the French course get Copy that. Paste that in. Okay, so there we got our two files. Now I need to eject the Kobo. Don't just unplug it. Doesn't like it. Okay, remove it. Uh, 
and we're going to restart it. So long hold on. That's just sleeping. Long hold on the off button. That will turn it off properly. <laughs> Not my book of choice. And then turn it back on. It says. There we go. And then to load the maps onto the Kobo, go into either fly or sim. Let's go into sim for this one. I've set the orientation to landscape, so it's going to come up like this. Then to access the menu on the Kobo, you're just going to do a swipe from top to bottom and then up again in one movement. Brings up the menu. And then configure. And then go on to page two. And you've got system on the bottom right. Then site files at the top. Then map database. So we're going to select FRA course for Corsica. Airspaces. And we've got French there. Once that's selected, you can go click close. You can do the same for if you want to download any waypoints. You can do that for XC saw as well. You just fill in the part there. So close it and it will load the files into it. This can take some time. It only takes a long time in the first time. After that it does it quicker. Okay, so it has uploaded the maps and it looks like the French airspaces does cover Corsica as well. Zooming out just by swiping down. Yeah, so there we go, all the airspaces of Corsica. And that is how you load maps and airspaces and waypoints. This light here on the GPS will flash all the time it's looking for a fix. Once it has a fix it stops flashing if you're wondering. And that's it. Thanks.